All right, we're live here in Tequila. Samar, tell me your name and where you're from. I am Samar Jeet from India. Okay, and what, what brings you here all the way to across the, across the world? Well, um, I was working with the Indian Youth Climate Network in India, and I thought this would be an excellent way to build the international movement. And is it true that uh, when you get home, since you're part of this new media track, that you're going to launch the world's largest climate campaign? Yeah, yeah, definitely. That's, that's what we're <laughs> working on. What's the, what's the biggest deal in India right now? Um, the biggest deal in India right now, actually there are a number of them, but um, I think creating awareness amongst people so that they step up and act, and also getting the government to change its policies. And uh, how did you first hear about 350? Um, 350 and uh, IYC and the Indian Youth Climate Network have been working a lot together in the past. Uh -huh. And uh, we've, we've had a number of different uh, events to create awareness about 350 and the issue of climate change in India. So, so that's how it came about. What kind of events do Indians like to participate in? Um, or what kind of events do you think are successful in India? Um, uh, I think more which are more creative, full of dance, music and otherwise will, will really get Indians' attention and, and then you can talk to them about the issue. So um, if, if they're more interested in it, then you can have talks and you can have uh, presentations. But I think the way into an Indian's heart is either through food or <laughs> dance or music. And, uh, what should every American know about Slumdog Millionaire? Um, that it's just 10% of what India is. 10% accurate? 10%. 10 of That's pretty India low. Is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. India is, India is so much more than that. Yes, they are poor people. And yes, they are slums in Mumbai. But um, that's, and I won't even say 10%. I would say even lower. With, with every state having its own culture, language, music, art, dance. Um, if you really want to experience India, experience that, experience the architecture. Um, don't, uh, I mean, yeah, the music is nice and the story is really good and I really like the movie. But you can't generalize a country yeah. on one movie. Fair enough. All right, so we'll go to India. Thanks so much.